Hello, my name is Sayyid Ali Asher Rizvi and I'm a student of Curtin University, Dubai, currently enrolled in my final year of Bachelor's of Science in Computer Systems and Networking. This video is the first part of my Computer Technology Project Part 1, which is supervised by Mr. Sali Ismail. In this project, I would be using blockchain technology to verify certificates or any kind of documents. These are the contents you would find in this video. And this is just the overview of the whole project and I will be giving out much more detailed information in the further videos. So let's proceed. So what exactly is blockchain? And let's look into a brief explanation about how blockchain works. A blockchain is literally a chain of blocks. It is a growing list of records called blocks that are linked using cryptography. Each block contains data in them which is encrypted with a cryptographic hash of the previous blocks. So basically it means that they're all linked together. Blockchain technology is a very transparent technology as all of the transactions and the timestamps are publicly available. But what's really amazing is that you can't really figure out what it really means as it's all encrypted. Plus the whole blockchain technology is decentralized. Basically it means that there is no government ruling it. So let's look into a little history about blockchain. The first work on the cryptographically secured chains of block was described in 1991 by Stuart Harbour. But the first work, the first blockchain technology was conceptualized by a claimed Japanese person known as Satoshi Nakamoto in 2008. Nakamoto improved the design in an important way using the hash cache like method to timestamps block without requiring them to be signed by a trusted party. This is the person who invented Bitcoin, the most famous and the well-known cryptocurrency. Here I will be mentioning some of the points that why do we need blockchain? Why is blockchain needed? So in this vulnerable network environment, blockchain is one of the finest example of security as every block of data is encrypted which basically means that hacking blockchain is almost close to impossible. Hacking blockchain means that someone is trying to control more than 51% of the total computing power of the whole blockchain network, which is again impossible. Bitcoin is an application of blockchain. It's a very famous cryptocurrency and the only way to steal a Bitcoin is that for a thief to trick you. That's the only way you have. So as our technology is evolving, blockchain is being implemented in many uses, such as cryptocurrency, smart contracts, financial services, supply chain, and many more. As of now, we have some basic knowledge and some brief information about what blockchain is. So we would be jumping right onto our project topic, which is certificate verification using the blockchain technology. It is not just for certificates, we can verify any kind of documents using this technology. So I would be mentioning some of the problems we face in today's world while verifying the documents. So the first main problem is that the ordinary document verification is a very slow process. It takes a lot of steps, involves a lot of man work and a lot of phone calls, a lot of emails. So it takes a lot of time. The next problem is that there could be tampered or forged document which looks too real and it cannot be traced. And the next problem is that the receiver of the document won't be aware of the document history and cannot trace it all the way back. Like an example, a student receives his academic degree and goes to apply for a job in a private sector where all the certificates are needed to be verified manually. So again, it would take a lot of time and they don't even know that the degree is original or not. So there have been cases where students have produced a fake degree and it was too difficult to identify it. This has been a long-standing issue in the academic community. So the solution of these problems are in blockchain technology which is really safe and secure. So we would be using the technology in this project we are going to develop 
the decentralized certificate verification application on Ethereum blockchain or we might even use Microsoft Azure blockchain services. We are selecting this technology because it is traceable, tamper-proof and encrypted. By integrating the blockchain technology, we will be able to eradicate the problem of the fake certificates. We will use smart contract at the back end to interact with the blockchain and encrypted hash value of each document will be stored in the blockchain which will be verified against the user document. So this is the overview of the project and we will be talking about in details in my next video. So these are some of the references I've used to gather some information for my project and for this video particularly. And I will be giving out more information in my next video which will be much more detailed about the project. This was just the overview of it. So thank you for taking your time out to watch it.